Hi, this is Dina with Digital Hotcakes, and I'm in ProShow Producer 5, and I'm going to show you some of the cool things you can do in ProShow with our new product that's called Sparticles. Let's take a look. Okay, what I've done is I've actually incorporated Sparticles into a couple of slide styles and I've used it as a transition. So let's let's delete all these slides and build them over so I can show you how, how we do that. All right, let's, gonna, let's build our first wedding slide. We're going to drop in our photo of the bride and I'm going to set the slide time to five seconds. I double click on the slide to open our slide options. Now the, the background I used to um, in this particular slide is called Pastel Glam and I'm using the MOV. You can use the AVI, both will work in your ProShow Producer program. Now we want to add this to the slide with, our, with the photo of our bride and we can do that two ways. We can use the Add button here, Add Image or Video, or you can just grab it and drop it over. Now it's important that the, that animation clip is in layer two and with your photo in layer one. Now after that, that animation comes in, we need to do one more thing to it. Go up here under layer settings and down here under layer setup under aspect, you see it's set to auto. You need to change this to 16 by nine. That lets ProSho know that that is a widescreen clip and then your little circles will be the correct shape. If you don't do that, then you can have funny looking circles. Okay, next we want to um, actually apply that slide style. So I used a, a slide style from, from the Pro Show uh, Wedding Style Pack that I purchased from Photodex, and it is Wedding 17 Single 1. So I'm going to apply that slide style, and as you can see, Sparticles is already in there. It's Okay, and last thing we need to do to this slide is put a vignette around our picture of the bride. So let's click on right here on layer three, which is our, our picture of the bride, our landscape, our landscape image. I'm going to click adjustments. I'm going to click on vignette. And I'm going to use ellipse, an ellipse shape for the vignette. And then you can play around with the, the size here. Right about there, click OK. And then I'm going to go back under layer settings and I'm going to I'm just going to pull her down a little bit. Okay. And then we're done with that slide. Now the second slide that I had created, I was just using um, Sparticles as a transition, which is pretty easy and it gives you a pretty cool effect. And the, the transition one I used is called the Bokeh Haze. So you just drop that into a slide and you can make your transition time however long you want. I'm just going to put a couple of seconds on it. But once again, let's double click on that to open our slide options because we have to change that aspect ratio to 16 by 9 so our circles are the right shape. And you, did you see them change there? Here, let me put it back. Funny looking circles. Okay. All right. Now the last slide, I was using a, pic, a picture of Kristen here. And um, we're once again going to add sparticles to a slide style. I'm going to change my slide time to six seconds. Okay, we have our, our picture of the baby, so let's bring in our animation. And for this um, for this slide, I had used the animation that's called Pink Boca. And as you can see, I'm using the AVI. See, I used the MOV before. They both will work in your Pro Show. I'm just going to drop it over. And then I'm going to set that aspect ratio to 16 by 9. Okay, and after I do that, Let's apply our slide style. For this, I'm using one of the slide styles that comes with ProShow. It's called Soft Orbit. It's under your single image enhancements. I'm going to click OK. 
I'm going to click OK again, and we are finished. So let's take another look. There's sparticles in a wedding side style. And then we're using it as a transition. And then we have another sparticles that's embedded into another slide style. And you can do this with any of the slide styles. And you can also change the color of the sparticles too. Pretty cool. Thanks for watching.